Hi, welcome to our channel. I'm Neil and today I've got a 7 inch tablet to look at. Now this is uh, actually an Android 4.1 tablet and a Windows 8. It flips between the two. You can pick whichever one, whichever system you want to use. It's really, really useful actually. So what we do is, this is the packaging that's going to come in. We're going to unbox it, have a look at what we get inside and then I'll bring the camera in and really zoom into the uh, the tablet so you guys can see what it's like to use okay <clears throat> so first of all in the box we just get the first thing you get is a tablet okay so we'll have a look at that first now it's white on the back and black digitizer and black sides okay uh, there is a power port a tf card that can take up to 32 uh, gig i believe I'll check in a minute, I'll read out the spec. Earphone jack, we've got a USB port, we've got a HDMI port, we've got a mini USB. Uh, that's it for the top. On the sides, we've got the on, off button and the volume. And on the back, we've got a speaker, a camera, and a description on what you've got on the top. Okay, so that's pretty much what it looks like. Hopefully you guys can see that quite well. Also in the box you get a user guide, a mini USB to female USB. You get a USB to mini USB and you get a charging cable, okay? So that's pretty much the box empty. Now I'll turn it on and while we wait for it to turn on I'll read you out the basic specs. Okay, now you can find all of the specs on our website, so when you find the product then uh, you'll be able to read exactly what it can do. But basically, tablet brand is Eken, that's E-K-E-N. Its frequency is single core, its CPU is a VIA8850, it's 512 meg, HDD is 4 gig, uh, it's running Android 4.1, Jelly Bean, which tells you there. Okay, while it's starting up, uh, what else do we need to know? We know it's got HDMI port, 3.5 jack, rear camera's two megapixels, does not support GPS, uh, does support Wi-Fi, doesn't support Bluetooth. Uh, seven inch screen, resolution is 800 times 480. Um, it's a five point touch screen, uh, captive touch screen, Languages are Chinese, English, French, German, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Russian, Spanish, Polish, Czech, and others. So pretty much them all. Um, what's next? Appearance is white. Dimensions are 185 by 110 by 9 millimeters. The weight is only 335 grams, so it's nice and light. Um, the battery is 3200 mAh. And it has a standby time of between four to six hours. It also supports Office, so Word, Excel, PowerPoint, PDF, and TXT. So that's basically the the, the major specs of it. Uh, what we do is uh, we bring the camera in, and then you guys can really see what it's like to uh, play with. Okay. Okay. So uh, we we'll have a quick look at what it's like to use now. Um, this is obviously Windows 8. Okay. If you want to flip back to the Jelly Bean 4.1 Android, you just press these two arrows here and that flicks between the two. Okay, so it's really easy to swap operating systems. Uh, we're going to some apps. We'll play a game first so you guys can see what the screen is like. Uh, we'll just play Fruit Ninja because it's easy and I'm rubbish at games. <coughs> As you can see, it's really responsive wherever I touch. On the screen, it, it works fine. Hopefully, you guys can see quite clearly. Okay, let's stop. So that's gaming, really. Uh, I think touch quality is very, very good. Um, we we'll have a look at a movie. So we're going to Windows 8. It's easy to to function and use. Okay, find my videos, and then we just watch one to see what the, the video quality is like. 
Okay, as you can see, the picture's nice and clear. Well, I hope you can see anyway. Sound quality's good. So, okay, so that's what the picture quality is going to look like when you're watching a movie on it. Um, like I said, it's really easy to swap operating systems, just one button. Uh, the actual touch screen itself, if we pick up an app, I'll try my best to move it about for you guys. Okay, so as you can see, or you could see, there's not really a dead spot anywhere on the screen is great okay so that's pretty much what the touch is like and the response it's really really fast it moves through the screens as quickly as you can move your fingers um, feels actually quite nice as well it runs smooth it's nice and light you know you could hold this for hours and it's n not gonna you know cause your arm to ache or anything really I think they, these are the best parts about it the weight the speed and the picture quality. Uh, like I said, games are, are really responsive as well from touch. Um, I think that's about it. There's no point showing you the camera because it's not very powerful. Okay, so we'll pull the camera back out now and then uh, finish this video. Okay, so as a, as a tablet, I think it's really, really useful. It's a nice, decent size. I like the fact that it runs Windows 8 and um, jelly bean at the same time and the fact you can just swap between the two whichever one you want to use really really simple uh, that's another good key point uh, hand hand wise I think it, it's nice in the hands feels good um, looks stylish works reasonably well it's not slow at all and it does pretty much everything you want it to do so it's not a bad little buy to be honest. Um, I will put links below the video for this, uh, for the website and for this product. And if you're interested in any other tablets or gadgets, come to our website. Thanks a lot guys, bye bye.